So the, uh, the most important issue I really link with the uh, new technology coming in. So this new technology will have uh, uh, we will have to negotiate new work methods for the people inside and outside. So there's a big impact on the health and safety issue. But at the same time, there's uh, the fact that Canada Post want really to create uh, a cheap labor. So in some ways, they want to use this situation and this negotiation to uh, really negotiate uh, less wages, less benefit, and less pension for the people who would come to work at Canada Post so in the future. A two -tiered system. So it's all the yeah. issue around the two-tier system. It's really important. And we have something really around all the issue in health and safety. And they want to replace at the same time our sick leave uh, with what we call really a short-term disability plan. We do nothing uh, to uh, prevent injury on duty and do nothing uh, to uh, for the first days when someone can be sick at work. So that's a really big issue. It's about the future. Uh, of the uh, of the public postal service and what happened we have seven days left and in some ways we want to intensify negotiation we receive a global offer we'll address it and we'll uh, really uh, try to negotiate a collective agreement if not uh, we would be in a situation to strike or can kind of post to uh, lockout uh, May 25th and um, we have to send a notice of 72 hours. We are under the Canada Labor Code, so we, but we really want to push. But in some ways, we'll see uh, next week uh, what will happen around this issue, if we have to exercise or not our right to strike to really force Canada Post to negotiate. And um, just about that, if it does come to a strike, uh, two things. One, you mentioned checks will be delivered. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's really important because for us it's really important that uh, the check that people are living on checks like pensioners, retirees, and uh, uh, people receiving like uh, social assistance check that they will receive it. So we have an agreement with Canada Post on this issue, and that's really important because the fight is not between us and the retirees and pensioner and uh, people receiving check. The fight is between Canada Post and us. And the other part of that is. Um just because you're on strike doesn't mean all postal things will be shut down across the country necessarily. Uh, you want to talk a bit uh, about that? In some ways, it's always the issue of what kind of strike you will exercise. So we have uh, our national executive board uh, will decide in some way this week how we will address the issue and how we will uh, face what the employer put on the table and at the same time what kind of strategy uh, for the strike.